What's up, YouTube? It's your boy, Big Boy Fashion TV, and tonight I'll go on my WWE Raw review and highlights. So, if you guys are new to the channel, make sure you guys please hit that subscribe button, turn on post notifications when I go live on YouTube at 4 o'clock Eastern Time on Sunday. Follow, follow, follow my social media, my Instagram, TikTok, and Twitch, and Discord down below in the description. And let's get started. Now, Monday Night Raw was a C show. It, it was just a decent show. All right. Triple H walks out on the stage to begin night two of the of the 2023 WWE Draft. The new WWE Raw Heavyweight Champion is displayed on the stage next to the podium. Ground rules all remain. Remaining superstars are legitimate to be drafted tonight. As a result of Roman Reigns drafted to SmackDown, the new World Heavyweight Champion will be crowned for Raw. Um, Triple H notes that Brock Lesnar isn't legible eligible to be drafted. He neg negat he negative what is that neg neg negate that he will remain a free agent. Um select select NXT superstars are eligible to be drafted as well. The new roster take effect uh, after backlash. So we go to the WWE Draft Round 1. First pick, Round 1, Raw, Smack, Raw SmackDown Women's Champion, um, um, Rhea Ripley. I mean, the SmackDown Women's Champion, Rhea Ripley. So Rhea Ripley was the first number one pick to get drafted to Raw. So this means so Rhea Ripley had to swap titles, and we have to see. So then second round pick, second pick of Round 1, SmackDown Selects. Austin, the the um the United States champion Austin Theory. I knew Austin Theory was going to go to SmackDown. It, it's over. SmackDown is loaded with superstars on SmackDown. So I can't complain about that. Austin Theory is going to Smack got drafted to SmackDown. Third pick in round in round one. Raw selects Seth Seth Rollins. So Seth Rollins is going to stay on Raw. Then the four pick four pick round one is the is to SmackDown is Charlotte Flair. Okay, the first round ends. Triple H introduced Paul Heyman. Paul Heyman is met with a with a chore with a chore of bo chores of booze. Triple H shows Paul Heyman the new World Heavyweight Championship. In ring segment, Paul Heyman. This segment was just boring. Paul Heyman says the Tribal Chief Roman Reigns has asked him to speak on a number of topics. Number one, the draft. Roman Reigns and Solo Sequoia. Have all been drafted to SmackDown. Tonight will determine the fate of the Usos. The Usos did not win back their tag titles from Kevin Owens and Sami Zayn. He will address this with the Usos tonight in private. At Backlash, the Usos and Solo Sequoia will take care of the problem known as Kevin Owens, Sami Zayn, and Matt Riddle. Roman Reigns, Roman Reigns will be returning soon to SmackDown. And he will address all all of their all of these issues, including the beautiful the beautiful new world heavyweight championship as well. Wouldn't it look good in the island of Ravency? As of right now, Roman Reigns can't compete for the title because he won't be on Monday Night Raw. The worst part is everyone in the Raw locker room all walking around, flapping their gums about Roman Reigns. Man, who are jokers? Freaking clowns, Seth freaking Wallace interrupts. Thank God interrupts interrupt interrupt Paul Heyman. Seth Rollins knows that today should be like Christmas for Paul Heyman. Seth Rollins is still on his his show Monday Night Raw. Paul Heyman doesn't have to manipulate things backstage, so Roman Reigns can can continue avoiding him. Seth Rollins has a spoiler for Paul Heyman. He is going to win the new World Heavyweight Champion. At Night of Champions, and the WWE Universe will will see what a real champion looks like. Paul Heyman's phone rings and he answers. Seth Rollins gets to gets the crowd singing, so Paul Heyman can't hear. Paul Heyman screams at the crowd that he can't hear his tribal chief. Paul Heyman gets in Seth Rollins' face and tells him that he's pissing off his tribal chief. Seth Rollins asks the crowd how long it will take for him to get Paul Heyman down so he can stump him into the mat. So Sequoia music hits and he powers walks to the ring. 
Paul Heyman tells Seth Rollins that he, that all the same are being pulled to book so Sequoia versus Seth Rollins. Seth Rollins says they didn't have to bother. If so Sequoia wants a fight, he it's on. Earlier today, Adam Pierce let Cody Rhodes know that Brock Lesnar is here tonight. He would like to not have an incidents tonight. Okay, so we get Raquel Rodriguez and Liv Morgan versus Damage Control, Bailey and Dakota Kai. Now this match, now this match right here, it was just, it it was just um solid, solid tag team match. Liv Morgan and Dakota Kai trade strikes and pins attempts. Dakota Kai trips Liv Morgan into the corner. Bailey tags in and slams um Liv Morgan. Bailey missed an elbow drop. Liv Morgan tags in with Quell Rodriguez. Liv Morgan and with Quell Rodriguez over team Bailey. Dakota Kai tags tags Bailey's foot, um, which isn't a legal tag. As the referee holds Dakota Kai back, Bailey breaks to her eyes. Liv Morgan is sent out of the ring. Dakota Kai boots Liv Morgan out of out of her shoes. After the break, Bailey and Dakota Kai are working working over Liv Morgan. Lil Morgan managed to ta- to tag in with Quell Rodriguez. When Quell Rodriguez clears the ring, Bailey pushes Dakota Kai out of the re- out of the way and gets flattened in the corner by Quell Rodriguez. Quell Rodriguez land- lands her spinning splash on on Dakota Kai. Dakota Kai kicks out. Quell Rodriguez and Lil Morgan set up a skyscraper splash, but Bailey trips Quell Rodriguez. Lil Morgan fall, falls off for Quell Rodriguez's shoulders and lands on her lands on Dakota Kai's knees, which she puts up to turn to turn the corner into a nasty backstabber. Lil Morgan kicks out. Bailey gets a blonde tag. Lil Morgan lands an oblivion on Dakota Kai, but she isn't illegal. Bailey rolls up Lil Morgan for the win. The winner of the match damage control. I still cannot get over the fact that why is damage control are still together. I, they need to break up. And that's all I got to say. Damage control needs to break up. And that's all I got to say. Um, earlier today, Adam Pierce finds Rock Lesnar. Adam Pierce tells Rock Lesnar he would like to keep keep the peace tonight. Rock Lesnar chuckles and tells Adam Pierce, good, good luck with that. Okay. So we get WWE Draft Round 2. Hall of Famer Booger T and Queen Charmel are here as special presenters presenters for the following pick. First pick, round two, Raw. The undisputed WWE undisputed tag team champions, Kevin Owens and Sami Zayn, are drafted to Raw. Okay, the Usos are drafted to SmackDown. Okay, which they should have been broken up, but the Usos got drafted to SmackDown. Third pick, round two. The Judgment Day, Finn Balor, Demi Priest, and Dominic Mysterio are drafted to Raw, which is you know like Dominic Mysterio should should go to NXT. That's just my opinion. Okay, let's move on. Four pick round two, Smack SmackDown. The LWO, Rey Mysterio, Selena Vega, Cruz Del Toro, and Joe Quinn Wild and Santos Escobar is staying on SmackDown. So we get Braun Strowman and Ricochet versus the uh, Alpha Academy. A cop accompanied by Maxine Maxine Dupree. Um, this what this match I ain't really care about. Okay, Gable and Ricochet bear a hug. Bear, bear, Ricochet Gable and Ricochet bear bear each other down. Strowman and Otis tag in at the same time. Both men crash into each other. Neither will go down. Cross body by Strowman. Strowman body slams Otis. Ricochet hits a swan town off the off of Strowman's shoulders for the win. The winner of the match, Braun Strowman and Ricochet. This match I ain't really care about. WWE Draft Round 3. WWE Hall of Famer Shawn Michaels and Adam Pierce are are here as special here as special presenters for the following picks. Before HBK can announce the pick, Brock Lesnar walks out on the stage. Brock Lesnar walks to the ring. Adam Pierce pleads with Brock Lesnar. Brock Lesnar glares at him, and Adam Pierce backs off. 
So we get the in ring segment. Brock Lesnar. The in ring. This was this segment was just. They were just awful. This was a awful segment. Brock Lesnar asked the crowd in front, in, in Fort Worth, Texas, how it feels to be looking at the only real cowboy here. Adam Pearce comes to the ring with security. Adam Pearce tells Brock Lesnar he acts nicely, but tonight is about the draft, and that's more important. Brock Lesnar tells Adam Pearce he's going to need more men, more security. Pours down with the pours down to the ring. There, there are a, at least twenty five security twenty five security guards. Cody Rhodes music is Cody Rhodes appears behind Brock Lesnar. Brock Lesnar turns around and Cody Rhodes drops Lesnar with a with one punch. Security rush in the ring and holds Cody Rhodes back. Um, Brock Lesnar rolls out of the ring and holds his jaw as he walks away. Cody Rhodes is going is going nuts in the ring as Brock Lesnar smiles and backs off. So you mean to tell me there were twenty five security guards that can that can't break up Cody Rhodes? That's just crazy, man. But that was a god awful segment. Okay, first pick, round three. Um, WWE Women's Tag Team Champions, Lil Morgan and Raquel Rodriguez. They they are drafted to Raw. Second pick, round three, SmackDown selects Oscar, which was which was okay. Which was okay. Then number three, third third pick, round three. Raw selects the New Day, Kofi Kingston, Xavier Rules. They both been drafted to Raw. Okay. Fourth pick, round three, has select SmackDown selects the Brawling Brutes. So they, so the Brawling Brutes are staying on SmackDown. Backstage, Matt Riddle is excited. He tells Kevin Owens the same thing that since they got they all got drafted to Raw, they can't hang out all the time. Kevin Owens asks Sami Zayn if they can go to go to SmackDown instead. So we get Matt Riddle accompanied by Sami Zayn and Kevin Owens um, versus uh, versus Jimmy Uso accompanied by Jay Uso. Now this match, this match was okay for what it was. Jimmy Uso distracts the referee, which allows Jay to uh, to sneak attack Matt Riddle as soon as the match starts. Kevin Owens gets in Jay Uso's space. Kevin Owens drops to the floor and clutches clutches his head. Jay Uso is confused. Sami Zayn tosses Jay a chair and he catches it. Sami Zayn screams for the referee. The referee turns around and ejects Jay from ring. Ejects Jay Uso from for attacking Kevin Owens. After the break, Matt Riddle lands a lands a fury of offense. Matt Riddle tries a roll time, but Jimmy gets gets his knees up. Matt Riddle goes up top. Jimmy also pushes Matt Riddle off the top. Kevin Owens tries to check on Matt Riddle. Jimmy Uso super kicks Kevin Owens. Um, Jimmy Uso super kicks, super kicks, super kicks Matt Riddle for near fall. Basement super kick by by Riddle. Jimmy kicks out again. Jimmy Uso takes the pad off the turnbuckle. Sami Zayn distracts the referee with Kevin Owens slams Jimmy Uso's head. Into the into the turnbuckle, he he explodes. Matt Riddle drops Jimmy Jimmy Uso with a knee strike. Matt Riddle pins Jimmy Uso after the floating bro. The winner of the match, Matt Riddle. This match this match was okay for what it was. Okay, so we get so we get um number three. Let me go back to number three. Okay, backstage, Jay Uso asked Paul Heyman and Sol Sequoia why Sol Sequoia wasn't at ringside for their brother, Jimmy Match. Paul Heyman says Roman Reigns wants Sol Sequoia to focus on destroying Rollins tonight. So WWE Draft Round Four, WWE Hall of Famer Eric Bischoff and RVD are here as a special presence. Presents for the following pick. First pick, round four. Raw selects Trish Stratus. So Trish Stratus is staying on Raw. Second pick, round four. SmackDown selects Karen Cross and Scarlett. So Karen Cross and Scarlett are staying on SmackDown. Third pick of round four. Raw selects Ronda Rousey 
and Shayna Shayna Baszler. They they got drafted to Raw. Fourth pick, round four. SmackDown selects LA Knight, so LA Knight is staying on SmackDown. Men's TV segment. Okay, Men's TV. I'm sorry. Yeah, Men's TV. The Miz introduced his guest tonight. Raw, recent Raw draft pick Shinsuke Nakamura. Miz welcomes Shinsuke Nakamura to Raw. Miz asked Nakamura if he think he could win the new World Heavyweight Champion. Nakamura answered in Japanese. Miz says when Triple H said this will will be the work workhorse championship. He obviously meant Miz should be champ. Miz says Nakamura can't be number one, but he he but he will be a great number two. Um, they they should team up. Nakamura tells Miz he is something in Japan. Miz, um, so I'm sorry. They should team up. Nakamura tells Miz he is something in Japanese. Miz gets excited because he thinks it's something good. The Miz gets the crowd to chant it because it sounds amazing. Miz asks what what it translates to. To trans translate to Nakamura looks at Miz, um, crotch and says it means the guy with the tiny, tiny balls. I'm like, the crowd chants tiny balls at Miz. Then Miz attacks Nakamura floors him with the King Shouser. Okay, so we get all monster coming by MVP versus Anthony, Anthony A, A, Aliens. This match was trash. A L and A Lance Alance Dex Omos. Omos slams Alan sneaks snake eyes by Omos. Big boo by Omos. Omos hits the choke bomb for the win. The win of the match, um Omos. This match was this match was um terrible. Terrible match. WWE Draft Round 5. WWE Hall of Famers Molly, Holly, and Raw Dog are here at Special Presents for the following pick. First pick, Round 5. Select, Raw selects Ricochet and Braun Strowman. So Ricochet and Braun Strowman has been drafted to Raw. Pick um, Second pick, Round 5. SmackDown selects Shotzi. Okay, third pick, select, third pick Round 5. Raw selects Bronson Reed. Bronson Reed has been, you know what I'm saying, He's staying on Raw. Fourth pick. Fourth pick, round five, SmackDown selects NXT Pretty Deadly. This will say this now. This will say W for SmackDown. Okay, in ring segment, the judgment day. Damien Pre celebrates in Damien Damien Pre celebrates the judgment day are all being drafted to Raw. Damien Priest congratulates Ray Ripley for being the first draft pick. First drive back tonight. Ray Ripley says mommy is always on top. This Saturday at Backlash, Selena Vega will regret everything she's done to her on SmackDown. Everyone will see is the is the most dominant champion in WWE. Finn Balor says Damian Priest is going to destroy Bad Bunny and leave pieces of him all over. Puerto Rico, Damian Damian Priest wants Bad Bunny to listen to his Words carefully. Damian Priest goes on a rant on a rant in Spanish. Dominic Dominic Mister yeah Dominic Mysterio grabs a mic and the crowd immediately starts booing. Dominic Mysterio tries to say tries to say he can't wait to see them dominate at Backlash. The crowd isn't having it since the L W L W O got drafted to SmackDown. This is the last time he can. Embraces his dad be dad. The LWO interrupts Mysterio and says that it says they aren't running. They got drafted to SmackDown. He's glad. If Dominic thought getting beat with a belt at WrestleMania was bad, the next time he might break out the the chant 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 la. Okay. They they are going to enjoy watching Bad Bunny taking out taking out Demi Priest at Backlash and Selena Vega winning the SmackDown Women's Champion from Rhea Ripley. Okay, let's move on. So we get the Judgment Day. 
Um, Rhea Ripley, a combi, uh, yeah, the Judgment Day, Rhea Ripley, Dominic Mysterio, and Damian Priest versus the LWO, Rey Mysterio, Santos Escobar, and Selena Vega. Now this six man, this the six, the six man tag, the six tag team match. This this match right here, this was a quick tag team match. Santos Escobar land a double knee strike to Damian Priest. Santos Escobar runs into a big right hand from Damian Priest. Damian Priest decks um Mister Rey Mysterio while he's on the apron. Damian Priest tries to say springboard, but it's a knee from Santos Escobar. Dominic Mysterio rushes the ring and gets and, and gets a backstab from Santos Escobar for his troubles. Dominic Mysterio apron and Dominic Mysterio, I mean Rey Mysterio dives off the apron, lands a slanton after the break. Santos Escobar tags in Rey Mysterio who clears the ring. Rhea Ripley hits the ring and tries to press slams. Um, Rey Mysterio, but Selena Vega surprised Rey Ripley with a six one nine. Rey Mysterio sets up for the six one nine on Demi Priest. Rey and Demi Demi, I mean, I'm sorry, Dominic trips Rey Mysterio. Santos lands a suicide dive on Dominic. Rey Ripley drop kicks Santos. Selena Vega surprised Rey Ripley with a meteor off the apron. After after a series of counters, Rey Mysterio sets up another six one nine. Ben Bella jumps on the apron and takes the move to save Damian Priest. Damian Priest pulls Rey Mysterio into the ring and hits South of Heaven for the win. The winner of the match, the Judgment Day. The ending, the the ending was I like the ending by Damian Priest, um, but you know it is what it is. But the match itself, um, I might as well say it was just it was just there. It was just there. That's all I gotta say. It was just it was just there. Okay, backstage. Brock Lesnar is in his head it's in his head. He has been sent he has been since the day after WrestleMania. Cody Rose says we'll find out tonight that Brock Lesnar is human. Brock Lesnar doesn't have to win that backlash, but Cody Rose does if he doesn't the idea of finishing the story doesn't exist. He'll have to go back. He had to. He had to go to the back of the line, and he will not. He will not. Not now. Not ever. Okay, let's move on. So, WWE Draft Round Six. JBL and Teddy Long are here at, at are here as special present presenters, um, uh, for the following pick. First pick, round six, Raw selects the Alpha Academy. Alpha Academy has been drafted to Raw. Round, uh, I'm sorry, second pick, round six, SmackDown selects Rick Boogs. Okay. Third pick, third pick, round six, Raw selects NXT's, NXT, Katana, Katana, Chance, and Kaden Carter, which is a W. I like that. I like that. Fourth pick, round six, SmackDown selects Cameron Grimes. Two new Cameron Grimes. So Cameron Grimes has been drafted to SmackDown. And that's a W for SmackDown. Like I said, SmackDown is loaded with superstars. Okay, so we get the main event of the evening. Seth freaking Rollins versus Solo Sequoia accompanied by Paul Heyman. And this, ma- this main event was quick. Quick main event. Solo Sequoia blocks blocks his ears in the his ears as the crowd sings Sephiroth's song sings Sephiroth's song Sephiroth almost lands the stomp but Sol Sequoia avoids it Sol Sequoia knocks Sephiroth into the corner Sol Sequoia pounds on Sephiroth Sephiroth fires fires back and sends Sol Sequoia over the top Sephiroth calls for a dive Sol Sequoia rolls back in the ring and surprised Seth Rollins with a spinning wheel kick. After the break, Seth Rollins catches Sol Sequoia with an insecurity. Sol Sequoia missed a splash in the corner. Seth Rollins fires, fires back with a strike after a strike. Seth Rollins lands multiple suicide dives. Um, Sol Sequoia is sent back into the ring. Seth Rollins missed a flying knee. Samoa job by Sol Sequoia. Paul Heyman is on the on the phone 
outside the ring. For uh, Seth Rollins reverses his finish, just reverses his finish solo into a into a roll up. So Sequoia kicks out. So Sequoia avoids a close line by Seth Rollins and hits a spinning solo. Seth Rollins kicks out. Um, Seth Rollins slaps So Sequoia in the face and calls him Roman. Roman, you know, Roman, um, you know what? So Sequoia lands another spinning solo instead of pinning Seth Rollins. Um, so Sequoia ran down, ran down strikes. The Usos hit the ring and attack so uh, attack Seth Rollins. The referee calls for the bell. So Sequoia has been disqualified. The winner by the disqualification, Seth freaking Rollins. After the match, Kevin Owens, Sami Zayn, and Matt Riddle hit the ring and a huge brawl breaks out. And Monday Night Raw goes off the air. The ending was just, was just terrible. And that's all I got to say. And Monday Night Raw goes off the air. Okay, um, like I said earlier, Monday Night Raw was a decent show. So it was a decent show and I give it a C. That's all I got to say. But anyway, if you guys enjoy my WWE Raw review on highlights, please give this video a thumbs up. Comment down below. On what are your thoughts on WWE Raw review? What are your thoughts on Monday Night Raw? Because Monday Night Raw was a decent show and I give it a C. But anyway, um, if you guys are new to the channel, make sure you guys please hit that subscribe button. Make sure you guys full watch the video. Turn on post notifications to get notified when I premiere a brand new video go live on YouTube on Sundays at 4 o'clock Eastern Time. Follow my social media, my Instagram, TikTok, and Twitch, and Discord down below in the description. And I will see you guys tomorrow for my WWE NXT review on highlights. This is your boy, B-Boy, Facts Channel TV. Have a great night. Stay safe and always stay positive. KFG crew, KFG kings, too sweet. I'm out of here. Gang.